Yeah. Gives a little fire protection. Alright, let's see if we get into any battles. With a T-Rexor. First battle, T-Rexor. Nope, Gratz. Okay, these guys should be a good source of status effects. What is this status effect? Confuse? Silences. Oh, that's actually pretty good. Um, hmm. We'll draw one more time, then we kill it. I don't really want to stay here for, uh, just for silences. Not really worth the wallet. Not worth the hassle, you know. Okay. That's ah, so she's asleep. As a side note, if you have the the generator ability for Christus's uh, ultimate her, her limit break, uh, you can get uh, you can one hit uh, KO a T Rex or. So uh, keep that in mind if you have trouble. Well, turn down that volume. There we are. Four AP. That means Gratz have two AP per monster. Not bad. Don't need that blizzard. But yeah, you have a higher chance of fighting T Rex source here in the training center than you do um, out in the forests. It's still a low chance, mind, but... Yeah. Alright. In we go! To the secret area. This is the only time we ever get to come here. Yes. Talking. I haven't been here for a while. You know, for a view like that, the train center really has to be really far out. Alright. What time is it? It's after midnight. Oh well. Okay. I acquired the chip. I'm no longer an instructor as of now. I'm a member of C now, just like you. Who knows? Maybe we'll end up working together. All right. Oh really? That's all you gotta say. Uh, yeah. That's how. If that, ah, if that's how it was decided, you have to abide by it. She's like dense mother. Mm. They told me that I fail as an instructor. Basically, that I lack leadership qualities. No, really, she's a pretty good teacher, from what I saw. I was a seed... Uh, ah. I was a seed by age 15, got my instructor lessons at 17. Dang. It's only about a year since I... It's only been about a year since I got it. So, you're 18? I wonder where I went wrong. I did my best. Are you listening? She doesn't look 18. Are you done yet? I don't want to talk about it. What am I supposed to say about other people's problems? I'm not say I'm not asking you to say anything. I just want you to listen. Then go talk to a wall. Dang! Aren't there times when you want to share your feelings with someone? Everyone has to take care of themselves. I 
I don't want to carry anyone's burdens. No leadership qualities, failed instructor? Perhaps they're right. I don't know if they explicitly state it, but, uh... If memory serves, Quizzes actually has a crush on Squall. Which is kind of why she was, uh, out here. I think she wanted to confess. If he was more, um... Open. <laughs> about everything. But no, no, he's like, you know... Whatever. Go ahead. Hair flip. <laughs> Ah, three grants. So six AP, not bad. Oh, let's just nuke him. And Nexus. But yeah, the difference between um, a person with max affinity or compatibility with the Guardian Force and someone who has, say, the base is night and day. You can literally summon uh, a max compatibility one while someone's summoning the other one at about um, a fourth of the bar and you, they'd still get get there before the other person. It's obscene how quickly it goes by. And there they go. Not bad. Sorry, read something coming up. Go around the tree. Somebody help. Come on, Squall. Squall. Squall? Christy? So she knows us. Okay, so, this is... Uh, huh. Ronaldo and Raldo. Three Raldos. Okay, on this guy. This is the uh, Gualdo, which is the big flying uh, monster in the back. Uh, around 1,314 HP. Gives us 5 AP. You can, st you can drain, um, or draw. Sleep, blind, and shell from it. At level 30 to 100, you can get Pain, which is a high, high level spell. Um, it will drop Wizard Stones, or you can mug them that. Uh, do. It is weak to Wind Spells. It has Flying, so it can't be affected by Ground Spells. It can be KO'd through uh, the... Detonator generator effect from Christus. And a few other effects. Uh, Doom, drain, eject, KO, poison, sleep, slow, stop, and the end. The little Raldos. Um, let's see here. Around 111 to 6,700 HP. That's max HP. Um, you have to do a lot of grinding to get to that. But they'll have generally fire and thunder spells and protect. So fire, Fira, Firaga, Thunder, Thundara, Thundaga, protect. Wizard Stones give us three AP per. Uh, do vulnerable to darkness, Doom, Drain, Jet, KO, Poison, Stop, Slow, Sleep, and the End. But no um, elemental weaknesses by the looks of it. Okay. And we do have Aria. <clears throat> Even Tornado. Match saving this for later. Let's go to Nexus. Yeah, that's how quick um, a Max Affinity goes. It's obscene, I love it. That long... X, it's so annoying. Nice. Killed them all. Go, Nexus. 
Oh, she's beastly. I love her. 16 Wizard Stones, 14 AP. Learn Move Fine. Go Lilith. Ah. It's not safe here. Please, let's go. All right. Mysterious. Who was that? I feel there's one thing I should mention important about Guardian Forces, according to the lore of the game. Um, in order to draw upon their power, they actually need to feed off of something. So, when you summon a Guardian Force, they take away your memories. At least, small stuff. Generally, you know... Um, uh, during, like, you know, what you have for breakfast or stuff like that. Um, but the stronger the Guardian Force, the more memory they take. So, that's the lore. Squall, it's not like everyone can, uh, get by on their own, you know? Says who? So, yeah, it's a good, it's a good thing to know about. Also, I did find out that Vitality and Spirit are the defenses. Vitality is for physical defense, Spirit for magical. I was uh, certain that was the case, but not 100%. I found out recently that it is. So, yay. Okay, sorry. Finally, there you are. Where the hell were you? I was looking all over the place. I was making out with our instructor. What about you? <laughs> God, sorry. <laughs> Bad joke popped into my head. We're both down. We're both members of Seed, right? Well, guess what? We get our own room, baby. Your new room's right across the hall from your old one. As well as I was asked to tell you, man, it took me forever. Good for you. So we have our own room, which is nice. Not a bad little room. Now let's go to sleep. I can see in the in a remake of this game that they would include um a shelf the shelf on the right where you can put like little trophies on. Squall, it's our first seed mission. Looks like we're going to Timber. Meet by the front gate. Hurry. Ugh, fine. Weapons monthly issue, April issue. Awesome. Well, let's see what's in it. I think this is our level 2 weapons. Yep. This is what the level 2 weapon looked like. It's literally the same thing, just with a, um ivory handle. An, improved in power, uh, an improvement in power over the revolver, Shear Trigger uses the same blade as the revolver, but the gun aspect is now more powerful. Um... If memory serves, Shear Trigger may also unlock the second level limit break. Let me check. Uh, yeah, it will unlock Faded Circle. With the Maverick, the combatant can deliver direct punching blows to the enemy. The gloves are made of black leather and have metal plates on the knuckles. Ow! Weapons that can be used from a distance have many advantage. advantages. The pinwheel is one of the, most, one of the more basic projectile weapons. This is another character we're going to get soon. This is their base weapon. Same thing with this. Guns have an advantage of range, but damage is less compared to swords. The Valiant uses powerful bullets to cause damage comparable to a sword. So, that's a shotgun. That can shoot from ranges, pretty much. Those are weapons for two characters we'll be getting in the near future. Squall is the um, only character that has a high range of um, weaponry. <clears throat> Excuse me. Alright, let's stop by the uh, library to see if the conceded seed's there. So we can get that said and done out of the way. If not, I'll try coming back here once we have Zell in our party, because I think we need to have him with us.
you. Nope. You? As we move forward, please let me know. Let me know. Let me help you. Thank you. Hi. Nope. Drop ones do refresh over time, but apparently that one just doesn't want to. Uh, hi. Good for you. <laughs> Poor guy. So, Xeed Seed's still not here. That's annoying. Like I said, I'll come back here with Zell and see if he's uh, here. Let's go, he's hidden in behind one of these walls. Which would suck if that's the case. I'll look for uh, off screen and see if I can find him. Not a lot of fighting in this set so far. There is a boss fight and a guardian force coming up soon, though. I'll, I'll end it after that. Selfies, tree close. One more minute. Oh, Zell. Made it! Keyboards are prohibited within garden. Have you forgotten? Oops, sorry. This is really cool. It may come in handy on a mission, a scene mission someday. We'll be the judges of that. Confiscate it. Oh man. All of you are members of Seed, but nevertheless, you're still students at this garden. Furthermore, because you are seeds, you must set an example to all others and abide by the garden's rules. Understood? Heh, <laughs> flumps him off. Well, about your first mission. You are to go to Timber. There you'll be supporting a resistance faction that is your mission. A member of the faction will contact you at Timber Station. The person will talk to you and say, the forests of Timber sure have changed. At this time, you must reply, but the owls are still around. That is the password. Just follow the faction's orders. Uh, just us three? Correct. We have agreed to do this mission for very little money. Normally, we would never accept such requests, but... I don't have to talk about that. Well then, Squall, you are the squad leader. Use, the be use your best judgment based on the situation. Selfie and Cell, you are... Uh, to support Squall and give your all to carry out the fashion's plans. Oh, and Squall, I forgot to give you this. It's a cursed item, but if one with enough power uses it, it should be of great help. Magical lamp. Alright. This is the boss fight I was referring to. And for things first... Let's rejunction everyone. Dante. Hex and Lilith. Magic. Saga, blind, Dante, oh, all, Zell, keep forgetting how to do the other way around. 
There we go. Water. The boss we're finding is weak against Aerio. Let's put that in. Forgot to equip him with actual stuff. Go. Actually, we're not going to be drawing stuff from him, so we're going to do item. Actually, let's have Squall with item. Or magic. Drop. Whatever. And you with item. Yeah. Okay. That way we have resurrection chances. Oh, low to ten. We got it. We got our first paycheck. Eight thousand gil. So we now have more money. That's how that works. All right. Music. Sorry. All right then. Item sort. Let's go and use a cottage. I can buy tents and whatnot in a minute. Okay then, now that everything's set. Does Squall have his He doesn't. Okay. I want that there. Okay. Save again, because this boss fight actually is kind of annoying. Okay. And... Oop. You should save your game before using it. Alright, and this summons... Diablo. Okay. I'm going to go through his stats so we can get ready. Who dares to my sleep? Um, who dares to my sleep? Okay, so Diablo's really annoying. He has a uh, level range one to one hundred. You can use this item at any point in time in the game to get him. Um, at low levels, one thousand six hundred. Anywhere between that and eight eighty thousand eight hundred. Uh, give us twenty AP. We can draw Cure and Demi from him uh, at twenty to twenty twenty nine. Cure and Demi. And at level 30 to 100, Kiraga, Demi, Holy, and Flare. So it's a good place to farm those out if you're higher level. Unfortunately, Demi, like every gravity spell, cuts your HP into a fourth. So dangerous. He will use an ability called uh, Maelstrom, if memory serves, or something like that line. Or Gravaga. This is bad because it's a gravity spell on everyone, dropping your HP low, and then he proceeds to rush you and kill you instantly. That's the annoying part of the fight. Um, he is vulnerable to wind by about an extra 0.5% damage. Uh, he is he is vulnerable to darkness, drain, slow, and the end. Which is why I put blind on um, selfie for a physical attack, so we can blind him. So he doesn't hit us when he, when he physically hits us. And it's also why Zell and Squall have wind in their attacks. Uh, just do. And he's guaranteed to drop his card when we beat him. So, let's fight him. He hits hard. Did I mention that? A good way to uh, really tick him off is to have a draw character use uh, draw cast uh, gravity on him. He's vulnerable to gravity as well. Speaking of which, gravity. Didn't work. Where's that wind? There we go. Yeah. Good damage. Not much, but... Mm. Stop with the demi bull crap.
This should be enough to get Zell's limit, though. Next question, Zell. Nope. Cure her. I should scan him as well, just to be certain. Alright, Demi on who? On Zell again, lovely. Where's that X potion? Magic. Scan. We should have no problem fighting him, really. You just gotta be careful. Oh, uh, he does use Gravija, which drains 75% of the party HP. Okay. Fly monster, so no ground attacks. Weak against wind, but not by much. So yeah. With his HP is low, he'll use that uh, Gravija. Uh, which damage the entire party to the tune of 75% of the current HP. So yeah, we have to be careful. I do want to check something quickly, though. Oh, it doesn't tell us. Okay. Um. Might as well. Draw cast Demi. Let's take a good chunk of HP off him. Oh, I didn't. Well, screw you too. We do just have to lower his HP to a certain point, though. Let's go! Dang it! Come on, get up there. Dang it! Screw it. But yeah, he only has a 50% uh, chance of being hit with a darkness spell, or blind. And since Selfies isn't that strong with her attack, she's not going to do much damage. I should just cast it and blind him. Ah, missed. Alright, who's it on? Ah, oh, selfie. You really don't want to get her down. If you do, I'll almost spam summon so I can try and find the end. Oh, you dumb. I'm not going to get it. Let's try blinding him again. I'm at that range where it can uh, kill me. Be a little bit lower on Selfie's HP and I can do it. Come on, work! Dang it! Who's it on? Not gonna be ragging up. Ah, I see. Okay. Lovely. It is ragging up, just not in the way it usually does. Double cast, you D bag. I really wanted to use her slot. I, I, I did it a little too quickly. But I need the HP back, because he's going to bum rush her, probably. On who? Wow, you really don't like selfie that much, do you, buddy? Alright, so now demi cast. Four thousand, nice! Still not getting it. Q. 
you bring her down. I'm waiting. I'm waiting for you to do it. Grab it, you. Oh crap. That's not good. Where's the cooking? Come on, do it. One thirty. Someone started rushing us too. Please be enough to finish him off. Double or break. On duel. Dang, he didn't. Too much sleep. Too weak. We win. Unfortunately, yourself you're not getting jack for that though. But we want Diablos. All right, in Diablos, we are naming. What name did I pick for you? Ah, right. Sparta! <laughs> My friend recommended this one. And ironically, the only person that has space is Dante. It's the person that has Dante. Alright, now if memory serves, he's the uh, earliest guardian force that has Mug. Yep. He also has a um, special ability to remove counter rate, encounter rate. Um, as we level him up, he will also gain encounter none if, if memory serves. Oh gods! I'm gonna focus on these first, then mug. But that's gonna be it for this set. I'm going to actually level grind him down at the beach like I usually do. So that's gonna be it for this set. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys next week. Till then, have a great day. Bye bye.